Hello, I'm just sitting in front of uh, the King Jan. Uh, uh, we call in uh, Rasavali Klangi in Jephna or Rattalu in Singhala and Rasavali in Tamil. So this is one of my favorite and very popular of the, you know, the people there. The one we produce um, in Jephna is also very nice one. And uh, inside is uh, the purple color. Uh, therefore, it is called the purple jam. Um, this is about, uh, you know, two kilos. And uh, this is from our garden. And uh, the last year we didn't get a, you know, uh, uh, good crop, but still we got a few of them. And uh, what we are doing now, you know, we don't, harvest everything at the same time. Whenever we need it, you know, we will go and get it. I think this is the last one. So what we are going to do is, you know, we are going to cook it. The cooking the um, purple jam or the king jam is not a curry cooking, but it is the cooking with the coconut milk uh, so that you get a, you know, very nice uh, uh, aroma and the color and the taste. So this is uh, one of the important thing. In terms of the nutritional value of this uh, jam, uh, they have uh, you know, a lot of antioxidant vitamins. And uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you uh, by cutting this one. I will cut it this one, so i cut, cut it. So it's cutting this, uh, trying to get the um, without damaging, you know, see that uh, there are the new growth is coming up. So I want to get them out um, so that uh, I can replant them. So that is with the root. So very important that, you know, we get that. Uh, so uh, that's what I'm doing. So see that, look at that, see the purple jam that uh, we were talking about it. And uh, look at that, see, see the nice one. So uh, I want to just show you that, you know, how we are going to take it, uh, this one, that uh, the root part of it, so that, you know, we can plant them. So see, we got the root part of it with the growth medium. Uh, so we will plant. I think then now what we are going to do is after that, you know, we are going to, you know, remove the skin and the boil it. This is the cross section of the, the purple jam. So you can see why we call this a purple jam. Uh, one other thing I'm showing this picture because uh, when you cut the jam, uh, you need to put them in the water, otherwise, you know, they can develop a little bit of brown patches around it. So that's very important when you use the, uh, the purple jam. I'm going to show you how to uh, cut uh, the purple jam. So we, you know, when you cut it, we need to put them in the water. So what we do is, uh, you know, we take the, the skin. So uh, make sure that you know you are taking the skin off um, and for several reasons the skin is hard and also the skin may be um, cracked and also it will be a um, uh, there will be a soil and other dirt so that you know once you cut it and put it in the water so that it will not uh, oxidize and oxidization might change the, the color of the purple and uh, so uh, we uh, cut them and uh, so 
try me delicately cut every curve and corner so the that's the way we remove the skin. Okay, so we have um, cleaned the skin and also that we have removed the, uh, uh, cut it into larger pieces. So we put them in the water. So once you put the water, so we, we ideally you should use the, the cutting board. Um, don't use the hand. We are doing this for just for the convenience. So when you use the sharp knife, uh, you need to be uh, very, very cautious. Otherwise, you may end up with uh, cutting your hand. Uh, yes, I repeat again. Ideally, you should use the cutting board. But my wife is using, uh, showing a little bit smart cutting hand. But uh, you never know when the knife will go through your hand. So you will cut them in this way more pieces and put them in the water then after that we take it uh, because we have already cooked uh, or we are we are going to freeze them some of them after we cooked uh, uh, some of uh, some part of it so this is the way we cut the slices and freeze them now we have uh, cut it and wash it and uh, um, uh, these are the cubes of the purple jam. So what we are going to do now is, you know, we are going to freeze them and uh, some of them we cooked it. So to freeze it, you know, put them in the freezer bag and uh, so that whenever we want it, you know, we can uh, use it. So this is the way that we, you know, freeze the purple jam so that we can use it uh, when they are becoming very rare to cut them. So what we have done is uh, basically we cut the, remove the skin and cut the, um, uh, cut, cut them into small pieces, then boil them and smash them so it came. Now we are adding the coconut cream. So you can see how that, uh, you know, is uh, um, coconut cream, cream is very important. Mm. So the purple yam and the coconut cream and you know that will be reasonably healthy and if you want sugar if you don't have any diabetic problem or anything you can add the sugar or honey or maple syrup or anything you can add into it so we usually don't add the sweet added sugar into it because the yam itself has a reasonable amount of sugar so <coughs> this is the way we cook it. We are cooked now. Let's cook into pudding. Or, you know, uh, so you can see that uh, you know there are how this has been cooked. There are there will be when you cook like that when it smashes you see a small lumps. The the lumps add a good uh, texture to the jam. So um, and. Uh, See, look at that very nice color, purple yam. So the beauty is that when you cook it, you know, they don't lose the color. So that is the, uh, um, the beauty of this one. And so I'm going to have my purple yam. So look at that, see, I love this one. Uh, take this uh, full Monty. Put this one side so I can see that I don't want to lose her even small with uh, very very nice and uh, I can so you uh, you have to eat when it is warm then you will really enjoy this one um, when I am putting this into my ma mouth you know it's always bringing back my old uh, memories from my Sri Lanka and in Sri Lanka, when you go to the farmer's market, you 
get plenty of them and uh, so here I am growing my own and not too many people are growing this specific variety so very creamy <coughs> and uh, as I said earlier when you cook it with the coconut milk that is the the beauty of this uh, purple jam come out very aromatic and thank you very much for watching this uh, video I appreciate your subscription to our YouTube channel thank you